Oh my god, look at them all. Oh my god. What's down here? What's this? An ant egg. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Yep, we did. Oh no. That's a problem. Welcome back for another episode of Grounded. In the last episode, we attempted to catch an orb weaver in an arc trap, and it worked, but it didn't work the way I wanted to. We also built the insect axe and the insect bow. If you missed that episode, I shall leave a link to it above. In today's episode, one of our keen-eyed viewers mentioned in a comment in the last video that we had a chip for Burgle. So we have to go see him today. I also want to make the smoothie machine, see what that's all about. And I think we need a better spot for a base because I just haven't got enough room to expand it. So we're going to do some base scouting today. So let's drop down because in tradition of bringing you intros from stupid places, that was one of them. I also found out that this thing can make rope out of plant fiber. So I'll take all of that good stuff. I want to make the ladybird armor before we go. So let's have a quick look at what that takes to make. Oh, wrong one. Workbench gear, go down, where's that? Because I had a look at this, and look at the defense. Oh, we need berry leather, so we're going to have to get some berries as well. All righties. Right. I forgot to put my tools away again, so they disappeared. But I signed back into the game last night, and I built a whole new set, so I wouldn't have to worry about it today. So let's take everything. Oh, I'm taking all the old stuff. Go away, crappy pebble axe. We're taking the insect axe. I need to take my arrows as well. The rest of my armor. Right. Let's fill our gut with water and head out and search. Do you know what? We'll go visit Burgle first. We'll go visit Burgle and then we'll go scout for a new base. So let's go. Come here, Burgle. I have a chip for you. What good stuff will it unlock? It nice to see a friendly face around here. Oh, it's always nice to see you. I found a burgle chip. An upgrade as good as good, good, good ketchup on fries. All right. Is there anything else I can help you with? Yes, I have some raw science. If you have any extra raw science, I'd be happy to, to, to trade you for it. Of course. Oh, oh my God. Look at the good stuff. Well, obviously, we're going with that first. We have 2,240 left. Torch upgrade. Yep, sure. Right, we've spent our monies. You've expanded Burgle Swap Shop. Grassland chip unlocks. Awesome! Right, we've got everything we need, so why not go out? Ooh, grass stairs. And we'll start scouting for a base. Grass floor, nice. What else? Come on. More nice, new, delicious stuff, please. Triangle floor. All right. I'll take it. I'll take it. Anything else? Oh, ho, sparkly new torch. I like the idea of building it on a rock. I know where there's some really cool rocks as well, near where that wolf spider was that we killed to make the insect ball. Because we needed his fangs. So let's go and check out over there, shall we? Ooh, this looks like a big rock. Let's have a peek at this, shall we? Oh, I like it. I really, really like this spot. I think we should put a trail marker here. Just in case. Can I say any clovers? Because we need clovers. No, it doesn't look like it. But I do like this place. Whereabouts on the map is it? It's right there if any of you guys like it enough to build a base. Oh, I think we should. Can we build stairs up to it though to make it get up to further so we can get up easier? Can I build onto this rock here? Inventory, craft, base building. Where's the stairs? Can we make stairs here? Just a bit this way? Missing ingredients, wait, we can. Does that get us all the way up? No, but it gets us close enough to jump. So let's start hacking some stuff up. We'll get some foundations down. We'll see what do. Right, guys. That got dark really quick last night. So all I did 
was run around gathering some stuff and piling it down here so when it comes to the morning we can literally start hammering the stuff in just pick up a lot of stuff like this we'll finish our stairs and our grass top and then we can get working on the base and the stairs are complete now we have easy access to our new nice flat base so let's start laying some stuff out like some walls around oh we need a door of course we need a door we don't want any tom dick or harry walking in so let's have a look in the base building oh that reminds me so i went to one of the analyzing stations with a weed stem and a grass plank because i was curious i was like do you have to research these will this give us more recipes and it turns out you do have to do the stem i didn't get much i got a couple of triangle walls and stuff from that but from the grass planks but we now have sturdy doors so let's put one of those at the top of our stairs and we can go ahead and start laying down a grass wall perfect let's get some grass planks down And the gate. Whoop whoop. We are done. Look at how much room we have. Now I decided to put windows here. Because it was a pain in the backside. I also had to make some scaffolding. Because apparently this was floating. Which I don't agree with. But look at that. We are completely protected. From everything. Anything that wants to come and get me. Has to come through that door. As you can see I have low water and low food. So I am going to have to make a trip back to the original home base but as you can see I've marked this Bravo and I'm going to mark that one Alpha but for most do you know what no let's mark this one Alpha because this is now going to be our main base and the other one can be a satellite base so mark it Alpha awesome right I'm going to run back to the old base I'm going to gather up some stuff and it's time to start moving in well guys it might have taken all night but I finally moved all of the stuff over all of the tools and the food in here all of the sprigs and the clover leaves in here insect parts in here building materials in here and finally plant materials in here now I'll put some stairs down because I've done a couple of tests with foundations and this is going to be the best angle I believe anyway to get a nice looking base so oh I forgot to close my door now that I've closed the door, let's get some foundations down, shall we? So we're going to craft foundations. Right, guys, so that's the foundations down. Six by six, I think, should be enough to give us a nice big base. We're planning on going at least two stories so we can get an even better view. But right now, it's time to head out. I have literally my armor and an aircon shovel to collect clear. And I'm not coming back until I've got enough to finish it. Oh my god, we are finally home. Guys, that legit took forever. Oh, let's get these down and we can start laying down our new base. And that's the last one. Yeah, this is awesome. Right, let's start laying down some stuff where we want stuff to go. Oh, let's start with a couple of jerky racks. They can fit in nicely over here. One there. And we'll put one there. Oh, cool, cool. Spinning wheels now. We'll put three down over here. Like so. We can spin all the web fiber for days. Dew collectors. They're next on the list. Put one there. 
put one over here. And then we're going to have a couple of water barrels there. Because I want two ways in and out. A back door, so to speak. Smoothie station. I can go there and there. Don't know if we're going to need two, but we might as well have two. Why not? What else can we put down? Need a workbench. I want to put the workbench over here. Because I might split it off into actual rooms. I'm not sure yet. We shall have to wait and see. What else could we use? More storage chests. We'll put one next to the workbench. We'll put one over by the food. Like so. One by the smoothie station. Oh, do you know what we could do with? A proper bed. We'll have a proper bed. That can go over here like so. Perfect. Everything's coming together and it's about to get dark. Let's have a couple of armor dummies to saw our armor when we're not working. We'll put it near the workbench. One there like so. One there like a so. Perfect. Perfect. You know what? Screw it. Let's do a couple of mushroom gardens as well. Spin that round like so. Put one there. Oh, we'll only have one for now. What does it take? A lot. Right, guys. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to sleep. I shall bring you back in the morning. We'll start putting stuff together. So, guys, as you can see, I've put everything down I've been able to. I need some acorn, some crow feathers, some bombardier parts, and some more quartzite for the other jewel collector. None of which I can get close, so we are going on an adventure to kill some bombardier beetles. We'll go up to the oak tree, we'll get some acorns. And we need to go back to that hole to see if quartzites respawn. So let's go. And we have arrived back at the quartzite cave and it's respawned. Awesome. <laughs> That looks like the last of it. Now we need some bombardier parts. Oh, there's one. Right, let's get him. If as long as we keep going side to side, you shouldn't be able to hit us with that. We should be able to kill him. So let's have him. Give to me your good stuff. We're gonna wreck your face. Come on, almost done. Ouch. Get mandrelled. Boom, give to me your good stuff. Found another one. Boom! Right. Arrows. Good stuff. This is the last Bombardier beetle we need. And then we can go home. Oh, I see a scab thing. Come on. You're gonna get some. Oh, we gotta go to hit that. Run, run, run. Put a bit of distance. And we'll just keep running them in circles. Come on. Don't go near him when you do that. Last hit. Boom! Right, give to me the scab. Flying V, and give to me your good stuff. Right, we can finally make our way home, which is... Oh, it's actually only just there, so I'm going to pick my arrows up and then we'll run home. Oh my days, we finally made it home. So let's finish off everything. Oh, I forgot clear. Absolute typical. Woo! And everything is done. Let's try and make a smoothie, shall we? How do I do this? Recipes memorized? None. Typical. Right. We're freestyling it. We'll go with an aphid meat. We'll go with a honeydew and a mushroom. Make something delicious. What's this? A smoothie? <laughs> with a question mark? Oh, I'm nervous about trying this. Four. No water filtration tablets needed. Well, that did diddly squat. So, guys, it's getting dark. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to sleep. And tomorrow, 
We're going to wake up bright and early, and we're going to start putting the walls on the base. Alright guys, before we start laying down some walls, I'd like to come over to the workbench and have a look what it takes to make the ladybug stuff. So it takes ladybug head, ladybug parts, and ladybug leather. And that one takes petals as well. I think we have all that. So let's go and have a look at the chests. Got plenty of petals, and we've got nine berry leather. So I do believe that's two out of the three things we can have. Got plenty of ladybug parts. Plenty, because heads are few and far between, and they're my favourite part. Alright, do we craft the shin guards and the chest plate, or the chest plate and the face plate? Oh, let's go with the chest plate and the face plate. Look how cool that looks. Holy crap. So we can go over here, and we can go and put the gear on the dummy. Oh, that looks cool as hell. Oh, that's awesome. Alright, let's start laying down some walls. Woo! I dare say that is going to take a lot of stems. Like, a hell of a lot of stems. Let's start putting some down what we've got. Oh, you've got to be joking. We are literally three short. Screw that, I'm going to get them. I'll find three stems somewhere. Ho oh, ho ho, and we are back with the final batch of stems. And boom. Do you know what? You two can just go down there while I come up here and just gaze in the glory. This base is going to be so amazing, and I cannot wait. We have to rebuild the silk winding machines because I had to break them. It wouldn't let me place the wall. Oh, I'm hungry. Let's go and get some food and then we're going to go and kill some ants. Ah, there's one. Come here. You're going to get wrecked. One more hit and you are done. Give to me your good stuff. We are home and we have all the ant parts. Let's double check what it takes to make the spinning wheel. Utilities, spinning wheel. Oh. We have no clear. But that is not quite a problem right now because I want to build the ant armor. See what that looks like. We've got two dummies. I mean, why not? So let's craft that one. Craft that one. What does this take? What am I missing? Raw. Absolute typical. So let's go out and get some rope, and we'll finish that off. And the knee guards. Now, I seen a tip on Reddit from a new subscriber. He says, if we wear all of the ant stuff, I feel a little less the ants now. won't attack us. So I want to put these on, and I want to go and test it out. So let's go and see if we get attacked. By the power of Helion, champion of the sun. There's a soldier. We'll creep up to him. Do you notice us? Oh, he doesn't. Oh, forget about food. I can live without food. Oh, right. What's down in the mysterious anthill? How deep does it go? Hi, guys. Don't mind me. I'm just one of you guys. Don't mind me. You'll never know. Oh, my God. Look at them all. Oh, my God. What's down here? What's this? An ant egg? Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Yep, we did. Oh no. That's a problem. Oh, I don't know how we're going to get back in there for our stuff. <laughs> okay, guys. So as you can see, I made some new ant armor. So let's go and investigate the ant hill. See what we can find. Right. Careful. Careful. You notice me. How do you notice me? Oh. 
would help if I put the armor on. Alright, alright, I've got the armor on. Are we still hitting us? I have to run away and come back. Right. Is it not aggroed anymore? Awesome. Aggro? No. Right. Let's go and check out the anthill. See what's down here. Nope. Pick the rest of my stuff up. Give to me the good stuff. Right. Oh, I see some raw science. Give to me 500. Holy crap. And eggs. Anything else in here? Oh. There was a human. At some point. Not anymore. Oh, I see something glowing on the floor. It's another scab unit. Yeah, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. Anything else? Oh, some more raw science over here. And a hole. Let's get the raw science. We'll drop down that hole. Give to me the good stuff. Another 500. Holy crap. Right. Ooh. A mint. I don't have my rotten bee shoulder pads. All right. I don't have my mallet on us to break. What's this? Oh, oh it's another burgle chip. Awesome. Right, let's see if we can find anything else. I've seen some more raw science. Give to me the raw science. Holy crap, we are on a roll. Light up, please. I can't see. Right, what's through here? I bet you guys any money I am lost. Oh no, we're back to where we were. That's alright. That's alright. Fuzzy tunnel. Where do you lead? What the hell was that? Back in a circle. Oh, I definitely know why I'm coming for quartzite. This place is full of it. Well, guys, it looks like that was it for the anthill. Over a thousand raw science in that one anthill alone. And a burgle chip. So before we end the episode, what say you? We go and see burgle. And see what new stuff we unlock. Woo! And we have arrived at burgle. Can I take this? Oh, I can take this. Oh my god, we have so much raw sides. Let's give them the chip. Oh, nice to see you too. Found another chip. It is indeed. Yeah, I'll trade you some raw science. Thanks to that anthill, I have ridiculous amounts. Oh my god, look at all the stuff. Five, oh, canteen upgrade. That's expensive though. Is there anything better we can get? That's screw. We'll go with the canteen upgrade. I don't think I've ever used the fiber bandage, to be honest with you. And we are finally back. So let's see what it takes to make the upgraded canteen. So we're obviously going to need this. We're going to need some rope. So we'll go into craft. Um, health and snacks. Canteen plus. Oh, it takes exactly the same. Just need some extra crude rope. All right, ease then. Right, can we craft this? Or do we have to go to the workbench? No, we can craft it here, which is awesome. So we'll put that one next to our old one. And we'll go and see how many drops it can hold. One, two, three, four. Oh. What? <laughs> what? So we got up to four before we were rudely interrupted by a bombardier beetle. So let's pick our stuff back up. I feel a little less squishy now. Any more? Nope. Four is the maximum. Do you know what, right? Just before I end this episode, let's jump down and kill that stupid thing. He's inside the rock. How am I supposed to kill him? Oh, oh he's going to be a problem in the future. Most oh, there's, there's a stink bug. I didn't even say that stink bug then. I ran straight into it. But with that, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. If you've enjoyed what you've seen and you want to see more, do go down below, hit that subscribe button. 
hit the like button. It all helps in the channel's growth, and I appreciate it immensely. I hope to see you back next episode where we can put a roof on this bad boy. And as always, peace. Two trees.